Okay, so now I would like to show you how to connect your Linksys phone box, that would be your IP phone box that you have purchased, how to connect it to your internal network. So, you have a Comcast cable modem. On the back of your cable modem, you have a power supply, you have a coax cable, and you have your ethernet cable. Your ethernet cable is the only one on the back of there, and it runs all the way over to your internal network. In this case, mine's just a single computer. In your case, it may be a switch or a router or, uh, or multiple computers. It makes no difference. So, on the back of your computer, it's where it connects. Remove that cable. Next, you're going to take this same Ethernet cable and you're going to connect it onto the back of your phone box. Your phone box has four ports on the back. Phone 1, Phone 2, Ethernet, and Internet. Internet is what you're going to connect right here. So you're going to take the back of this cable and you're going to simply plug it into the back of this links is for the internet. You'll hear the snap and it's now connected. Now in turn, you're going to have to connect this box to the rest of your network. Using another ethernet cable, you're going to connect the cable there where it says ethernet and the other end of the cable you're going to connect back to your network. Again, that can be a single computer, a router, a switch, whatever it is on your internal network. So you're going to take the other end of that, connect down to the back of your computer. And perfect. Now you have everything connected. You have your Comcast going over to your phone box, and from your phone box over to your network. Now, the only thing left to do is connect your telephone to it. You're going to take a standard telephone, it can be a cordless phone, modular phone, whatever it makes no difference to us. You're going to take the cable off the back of it, and you're going to connect it to phone one. And you'll hear it snap. Now in about a minute or two, everything's going to re-register back to the system and you'll have dial tone, you'll have internet, and everything will be functioning as one unit. If it doesn't come back up in a minute or two, all you'll need to do is simply unplug the power supply to your Comcast, Wait about 30 seconds and plug it back up. That will allow everything to re-register back with your Comcast. And that's all there is to it.